Hey everybody, it's Tanner with the Atlas Strange Shop back with another video. I did not even realize that we didn't put up a video last week until I think two days ago. And that's just because I have been insanely busy back there. My ADHD has me hyper-focused on all these different projects. Let me show you what we've been up to. So if you remember, last time I showed you this room with the lockers, it was in complete disarray. The lockers were along this wall, moved everything right here, added a proper lounge area, TV on the wall, um, get some game systems hook up in here. That way people who uh, who like bring their kids, they can, uh, they can just set them up and they can play Mario Party or some crap like that. Um, really excited about that, but let me show you the really cool part. We have officially broken ground on the outside area of the gym. Uh, we got like another 5,600 square feet available to us. Start over here. That way y'all can really see what's going on. So I put this fence up. This was, it was a really easy build. Um, the framing was the only difficult part. I found these fence panels from a used fit offense on Facebook Marketplace. And one of our members actually gave us this gate. So I was able to get the fence up at a pretty low price. Started clearing out all this brush that I always complain about anytime that I record any videos outside. All this concrete broken up. So, that really annoyed me. Whenever we first moved in here, the parking lot was in complete disarray. Landlord came in with a crew, broke all the concrete up, and pushed it along the side of the ditch. He said he was going to push it into the ditch to help with erosion. That never happens. We just gotta figure out a way to just haul that out of here. But now for the really cool parts. We have our Conan's wheel permanently set up now, as well as our Fingles fingers. I spent the last week, week and a half making these concrete plates with a mold that we got from Sticks and Stone. One of our members actually bought us a mold for it. So, you know, that's pretty cool. So now we have just weight that's on there to weigh the bases down. There's still a little wiggle room on the finger fingers. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm just going to buy a stall, three stall mats to put under each one. Hopefully the rubber will help reduce the friction for that. The next projects that are gonna happen, there's a few things that are gonna happen. I'm building power stairs, put right here. We're putting at least one outside rack right here. I'm gonna try to find some storage, that way that we can uh, we can keep some equipment outside. I'm even thinking about putting one of those, uh, one of those Connex rig systems right here. Somewhere in the general vicinity of where I'm standing, I'm gonna build our uprights for throwing. And we're gonna put it a Hercules hold right here. If you remember, we had a Hercules hold at one point that lasted all of five minutes. Someone's dad thought he was helping. We wound up breaking the whole thing, but we have learned from our mistakes. We're going to build it much, much, much stronger. And we're gonna add some safety features that other gyms have not added to their uh, Hercules hold. So I am really, really excited about that. So yeah, a lot of really cool things are happening in a very short period of time here at Atlas. I haven't taken a day off in a couple of months now. I am exhausted, but it is all worth it and it is going to be more than worth it by the time it is all done. The goal is, excuse me, to have it all done by January. I think I can meet that goal. Anyway, if you like this video, please like it and subscribe to the channel. It really does help us out a lot. If you'd like to come check this facility out, if you're in the Baton Rouge area and you want to join this community, hit me up on Instagram. That is the best way to get in touch with me. If you're not in the Baton Rouge area and you still like sports, you can do that a few ways. You can check out our programming options and our apparel options on the website. Or if you're looking for a competition, we have several coming up. We have the 4th Annual Rougarou Classic. That's on Iron Podium. That is happening in two months now. And then we have, we have a powerlifting competition. The next one of those that's happening is October 7th. You can find that on Lifting Cast. But until next time, keep that tightened.